Hey everybody, welcome on back to another video tutorial by yours truly, Mickey McGuire. Today, this is Osiris New Dawn video number 5, and we're going to be talking about mining materials. Uh, we're going to talk about the base metals, the precious metals, uh, the, the other kinds of metals that you can find. Uh, we're going to go to Azil. We're going to go over and talk about the minerals that you find on Azil. And we're going to be in space, so we might as well hit up the asteroids while we're up there, right? And then I'm going to pop in the mines and walk around and uh, see what pops up in the mine as well. Give you all kind of a rough a rough viewpoint. Your map navigator, your, your GPS locator, wh whatever you would want to call it. And you point it at a rock or, you know your rover or your base or whatever it'll tell you what it is which is pretty cool we're gonna go ahead and start mining this base metal here jeez there you go plutonium okay so in a base metal rock, you'll get iron, aluminum, magnesium, and a very small chance you'll get plutonium. So, good to know information. Uh, right now, I think they're, they have planned for five different types of geysers, but right now they have four. Uh, nitrogen, hydrogen, oxygen, and chlorine. Uh, so approximately three full containers for each geyser you'll get. So that's something to keep in mind when you're out. I call it the precious metal king or precious metal cove. Uh, location being negative 8.9 latitude, negative 7.9 longitude. And here you'll find carbon, you'll find precious metal, and you'll find base metal. Uh, and you'll find aluminum and iron and possibly uh, some copper, yeah, copper, carbon. I believe you'll find some lead up on top of the, the three pillars up there. Let's go ahead and mine some precious metal here. And you see I got copper, titanium, and gold. And I think this is just copper, yep. Okay, it's a base metal. Let's see, base metal, precious metal, there we go. No, that's not. <laughs> oh my goodness, oh, there we go. So, I'm not gonna stick around and try to wait for a diamond to see how many rocks it takes. Because in the 160 hours that I have played this game, I have gotten diamonds from the precious metal ores twice. <laughs> twice. That's how rare the diamonds are from the precious metal ores. So I wouldn't bank finding diamonds in the precious metal ores because this is not going to happen. <laughs> I wanted to mention to a uh, few guys to another location where there is a plentiful supply of precious metals. Um, it's going to be a negative 18 longitude and 19 latitude. Precious metal, precious metal, precious metal, precious metal, copper. All right. So here we are at mine Boldar entrance, location being negative 19.4 longitude and negative 8.6 latitude. All right, we've got some carbon. And looks like some more carbon, iron. We've got this dead body right here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, some more iron. Some aluminum. Iron. Well, this was certainly a bust. <laughs> uh, so, uh, keep in mind that it changes. You know, this time it's, it appears to be a bust as far as precious minerals go. Um... Magnesium. I got some lead. That's good. It's like some lithium. Lithium. Some aluminum. More more lead. That's good. All right. Uh, so like if I were to wait some time and come back in here, it'd probably be different. You know, it it, it might be you know two lead ores and an iron ore, or whatnot. Uh, so for those who don't already know about this place, I call it the glass house. <laughs> Location being negative 13.3 longitude, negative 14 positive, alright? And in this nice glass house, you will find lots of reinforced crates. Well, not lots, but just about as much as you'd find at a refinery. 
So it's kind of a good location for a base because um, I don't the the worm doesn't spawn. So we've got 17 and negative 16 long. Uh, I found plutonium inside of the second mine. Now that's not always going to be there. We got some more lithium. Nice. Okay, lithium is good for batteries. Some more plutonium down at the end of this long tunnel. Some more plutonium. Okay, this is the famous, famous location. Spoiler: When you play with aliens on, this is where the queen spawns and a bunch of her little defended characters. Um, now I don't know the percentage, but in this mine, see right now it appears to be plutonium, copper, looks like some more plutonium, lithium, lithium, okay. So in this mine, um, I don't, like I said, I don't know the percentage, but you'll get two diamond ores sometimes in this mine behind, you know, you'll kill the queen and there'll be two diamond ores behind the queen. Um, but not always, you know, I'll, you know, I could come back later and these will be diamonds. Here we are at looks appears to be 20 latitude and 9 longitude. Now, with aliens on, there will be a bunch of aliens that spawn here. But it's an excellent source of lithium. I mean, it's lithium everywhere. So, we are going to space. Nope, maybe, maybe not. <laughs> Spa at this point, spaceships do not require any fuel, and they do not require any diamonds to build. So, my suggestion to you is that build a spaceship as soon as possible. Because that will allow you to travel to space. And that will allow you to travel to a zeal. Hooray! Mm -hmm. ...base on this planet and be okay. But... What is that? Is that what I think it is? Oh. Diamonds! <laughs> 17.9 latitude and 30.3 longitude. There should be approximately 12 or more ores of diamonds. Just, just chilling. You know, we'll just go ahead and head up this. I think there's, there's one there. There's one there. There's one here. There's one right there, one right there. I mean, there is. You'll find tungsten, mercury, obsidian, and nickel on Azil. You won't find those on Proteus 2, at least at this point. Um, which I don't see why they would do that, because it forces you to travel to Azil, travel to space, which is good. Um, now, tungsten you use to make heavy walls uh, in your habitat. And I believe you use tungsten to make heavy assault rifle rounds. So it is important. But that'll wrap it up for this video. Uh, this has been Osiris New Dawn, video number five, Mining Materials. If I have forgotten something or you guys have a question or anything of that sort, please don't feel free to, to leave, a, leave a comment. Let me know what's up. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, leave me a like. And if you want to see more, hit that subscribe button. Thanks.